Hello, this is the new PS315C automatic panel saw from iTech. So there I'm gonna run you through some of the features, why it's exceptional value for money. So starting off, there are three digital turnover stops, all included as standard, supported on a heavy duty outrig table. They have backlights, and they glide effortlessly over the fence. The angle of this fence can easily be set using the knobs underneath. And the locking handles. The controls for the machine are set on this overhead control panel. So this digital number pad here is for setting the fence position. The maximum position for the fence is 1280. And that's driven by a lead screw, which is very robust. To bring it back to its original position, which was 500. It's simple. And yes, there is a coin there. To recalibrate the rip fence, all you need to do is hold zero. The blade positions are easily set using the up and down switch. And then of course we can set the angle using this switch here, which is displayed on the screen. and that's 45 degrees. The saw height is also compensated for here, which is 67 mil. The standard length of the aluminum carriage is 3.2 meters and 375 millimeters wide. It's made out of high quality aluminum. And it runs effortlessly over two round bars. It can be locked in any position using this lever here. To adjust the blade, change the blade, simply pull the carriage all the way back. Release this nut. And adjustments can be made. The machine takes a twin scoring blade, the 315 mm blade. Nice quality stainless steel pushing handle along with a decent quality clamp for timber and panels and of course a wainy edge clamp at the end. The overhead guard is hinged and secured using this cam locking handle. Um, but if you need to do maintenance on the saw and remove it, you can easily swing it out of the way. Along with the control panel, which swings right over to the side as well, giving you full access to the saw. The machine is fabricated out of chunky bits of steel. So you can see here with the support for the outrig table, the fabrication is made out of heavy duty steel plates. Also, the smaller things like the overhead guard assembly is reinforced with brackets. 
the extraction runs through the overhead guard and down the overhead mount through the back so that cleans up the extraction, makes it nice and simple. The electronics, I will supply a picture in the webpage, um, but they are made out of branded um, electronic components uh, such as Schneider inverter, which powers various functions on the machine. 